didn't want to get married, but we only got married because Gammy was crying. <laughs> Well, Gammy, this is what happened. When I, it was almost as if Gammy was like, you have to get married. So let's talk about the wedding. Knew, I was like, I never wanted to be married. I, I don't remember that. I remember feeling very strongly and, and wanting you guys to be married. I do remember that. Yes. But I don't remember your rejection of the idea of marriage. I remember the rejection of the idea of a wedding. I didn't want to wedding either. She didn't want to I was like, I don't want to get married. And now Gammy done gone to Will crying about, <laughs> I don't want to have a wedding. And now I'm being forced to have a wedding. When really, I just wanted it to be the two of us yeah. on a mountain. Because I was like, this is serious business. Yeah, wedding was horrible. It Jada, was a horrible <laughs> it, it was a mess. Jada was sick. sick. She yeah, was yeah, very yeah, unpleasant. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't cope because she was sick. She, was she sick, yeah. didn't cooperate with we were six anything. Months pregnant. Jada Pinkett Smith never wanted to marry Will Smith. Jada cried at her wedding and reported that it was horrible. Jada Pinkett Smith confessed that she really didn't want to get married to Will Smith. In fact, the Matrix actress, now on the roasting spit of Smith's infamous Oscars smackdown of Chris Rock and the Academy's decision Friday to ban him from the ceremony for 10 years, admitted to crying down the aisle before tying the knot with a fresh Prince of Bel Air star on New Year's Eve in 1997. In a snippet from her Red Table Talk Jada said, I was under so much pressure, you know, being a young actress, being young, and I was just, like, pregnant and I just didn't know what to do, I never wanted to be married. In the clip from 2018, which has resurfaced amid renewed controversy around her loose entanglement with Ranby singer August Alsina, 29, Pinkett Smith candidly recalls her mother, Adrienne Banfield Norris, also known as Gammy, 68, forcing her, and Smith to wed after she became pregnant with their first son together, Jaden, now 23. I really didn't want to get married, Pinkett Smith restated while seated around the circular table with her mom, as well as Smith, 53, and their daughter Willow, 21. We only got married because Gammy was crying, a chuckling Smith informed Willow. Will Smith banned from Oscars for 10 years, but he can keep his award. It was almost as if Gammy was like, you have to get married, so let's talk about the wedding, said Pinkett Smith, prompting Banfield Norris to confess, I remember feeling very strongly, and wanting you guys to be married. I do remember, wanting you and Will to get married, but I don't remember your rejection of the idea of marriage, Banfield Norris added. I remember the rejection of the idea of a wedding, but not of a marriage. Pinkett Smith then recalled being browbeaten into big day submission. I didn't want a wedding, and now I'm being forced to have a wedding, she said. I just wanted it to be the two of us on a mountain because I was like, this is serious business. Jada, and Will married at the Gothic-style Cloisters Castle in a suburb of her hometown, Baltimore, Maryland. And, despite the beautiful venue, Pinkett Smith, and her mom both acknowledged that it was less than stellar. The wedding was horrible, Banfield Norris conceded. It was a mess. Jada was sick. She was very unpleasant. She didn't cooperate with anything. Laughing, Pinkett Smith agreed, saying, and I was so angry about having a wedding. I was so pissed I went crying down the freaking aisle. I cried the whole way down the aisle. Conversely, Smith, who, in March, earned his first Oscar for a masterful portrayal of Venus and Serena Williams' father, Richard Williams, in the feature film King Richard, was so happy on their wedding day. There wasn't a day in my life that I wanted anything other than being married and having a family, he said during the episode. From literally five years old, I was picturing what my family would be. Pinkett Smith's visceral aversion to their nuptials notwithstanding, she and Smith ultimately agreed that getting hitched was, in fact, the right call. Will Smith warns Jada don't use me for clout in resurfaced video. And Banfield Norris apologized for failing to respect her daughter's protest about a wedding, and for being selfish by insisting on a lavish ceremony, owing to the fact that Pinkett Smith is her only child. The re-emerged Red Table Talk tape comes on the heels of more excavated footage from the couple's rocky, recent past. 
For a 2019 Instagram live clip, a seemingly annoyed Smith reprimanded his wife for broadcasting him on social media without his prior consent. Don't just start filming me without asking me, said Smith in response to Pinkett Smith showing his face on camera while asking, would you say, therapist Esther Perel, has been instrumental in you and I redefining our relationship? And when the actress dismissed her husband's upset as foolishness, Smith retorted, my social media presence is my bread and butter. So you can't just use me for social media. Don't just start rolling, I'm standing in my house. Don't start rolling. So far, neither will nor Jada Pinkett Smith has publicly commented on the resurfaced videos. Will Smith slaps Chris Rock at the 2022 Oscars? In what may be the most insane moment in the history of the Academy Awards, Will Smith jumped on stage and smacked Chris Rock while the comedian was presenting the best documentary at the 2022 Oscars. The unscripted moment arrived after the comedian joked about Jada Pinkett Smith's hair loss, a symptom of alopecia. Jada, love you, G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. Rock said, before the actress rolled her eyes, Will appeared to laugh at the joke at first, but then went up on stage. After Rock said uh-oh, Smith slapped Chris Rock before returning to his seat. There was a loud noise when Smith hit Rock, with people in the audience assuming it was a skit, and some claiming that Smith's slap amounted to a full-on criminal assault. The whole place was stunned, said one attendee. Rock told the audience, Will Smith just smacked the, sh, out of me. The sound was cut from the televised broadcast, but Smith yelled, keep my wife's name out of your beeping mouth. Rock said, wow dude, it was a G. I Jane joke, before Will repeated the admonition. Rock would go on to say, that was the greatest night in the history of television. Rock was clearly shocked and had difficulty struggling with comedy bit moving forward. Will Smith later won an award for best actor and shared his frustration that he was tired of people acting his wife and their family. Was it right for Will Smith to protect his family or was it wrong for him to hit Chris Rock what are your thoughts? Thanks for listening.